the Valerian Islands, jewels of the Ibero Sea. Long a center of naval commerce, the people here have struggled throughout history for dominion over these shores. Finally, there rose a man to put an end to this conflict. It's boy Zapkin the Giant Robots, and welcome back to Arctic Soga. Only reloaded simply because of the time between when I saved and when I stopped nodding off at the computer. We're still here in the Pirate's Graveyard. I've cleared out every stage except for the one with story. This is deep as it goes. Ah, the welcoming party's arrived. Oh, defiles our sacred ground. Sacred ground? Uh, what's this? I feel a draft from up ahead. There's something beyond here, isn't there? <sighs> Might be. Leave. Leave here at once. Or we will take your lives as penalty for your trespass. Azelstan, it's you. It's a trick. Not very clever, though. This is one face that won't come back to haunt me. Paul? Oh. a Dragoon. But why? Let's scout ahead. They have octopi and then a bunch of undead. So that tells us what we need to bring. Uh, I do kind of want to send you off. So what I've done is rearranged the units, how they are, and some of who they are. Going from Denim down to the recently recruited Angeal, who is serving a future function. That's all of our generics. No name, no face, no special entry. Our two super generics, Sarah and Voltaire, are back in their default class because. That's where I got to be a weirdo. And then you have all of your faces who are still their own class. And animals. And then Ned serving a later function for completion purposes. You are worth money. You are also here for money. So let's drop your number up into the 90s. And then, but Chobab and Chilgikin are, are interesting. If I were to class change Chobham down to, in, to iron, steel, or clay, it loses stats. And if I could class change Chilgikin up, it would gain stats. So, ultimately, Chobham is the is just the, the superior golem at this point. Even if I've had Chogokin longer, you are going to help feed our future dudes. Up here in the generics. Huh. I didn't. Or maybe I just undid it. But... I might have done it and then unsaved. I don't know. Maybe I didn't confirm it. Because I only need one lich. And that's Steve. 
but I don't have a generic Dragoon. Or for that matter, I don't have a generic Valkyrie either, but... Cudgels work. Over here, and you even get to keep that. So what I can do... Is... Yunin will be... For dragons... And cast here will be for dragoon, uh, for beasts. And look, your pincher attack won't hurt other friends. Uh, I change, I rearrange. Uh, Flightless is now our resident beastmaster. He gets to keep his hammer skill, and also, I don't have to keep putting the. Wing boots on Beastmaster Sarah for emergency safety when I can just put it on him. And that uh, Cham will have to start retraining herself in blowguns instead of cudgels. No change there. Uh, equipment though. Uh, since I'm having an undead problem. You're not coming on in this fight. So get yourself back in order. Now, what we need is to make room for Azelstan. So let's stop Canopus. Right, no longer at the end, you moved up. Uh, I don't need to recruit, but I can at least shut them down. you back on concentration so maybe these will hit more often I don't have you on a golf uh, I think I think we're good all right just one second and we'll get this fight on. Alright. I think... Yeah. Ideally. This, this should be good. Better be good. I hope it's good. Might have helped to turn myself on, too. You never know. Uh, why does it always start with her? That's what I keep for fucking up. I keep forgetting to switch you over to, for to off this holy water. Ooh, there was someone. All right, well, this is the last time you get a magic seed for a hot ass minute. He does have the bigger uh, 
the bigger exercise spell. Jump up here? Oh, 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 let's go. Hold on, let's pull you one space back. Oh, well, fine. Did I ever... I still never finished setting you up. He has Speed Star. I could have given him that shit. And this is why I want to send you off to one side. So it forces everyone to kind of turn. Uh... Oh, you can grab that? From the start, let's go. It's going to let you hit.
you might actually, yeah, you could finish them off. Yeah, take them out. And then we'll go. There it is. Stopper? As soon as I fix something, I unfix it. Uh, Ravenous. Can be deleted. Oh, okay. We'll do it that way. That's cheaper. Spirit Surge. Hot Oaken. I'm gonna give you a heal three, because you get that free spell in. Hop over. Uh yep. huh? Almost a hundred percent on a goddamn stone? Oh oh, I see. Or I could poison cloud. Oh, that's that that's the move. Chance to inflict misstep. As a, I wish these would scroll faster. Stagger. 
Can I get stupid angles? No, even worse. Do I want to put him out there, though? Oh, what are you? Counter, you are melee. You're a dark knight. All right, no stagger. Is it bedtime? Is it bedtime? Excellent. Damn, that sucks. Well, sometimes these ignore height. Oh, you're gone. Hi then. Can't see shit, Captain. You didn't stop me at all, sir. Is that a skill? That's a skill. Charmed? Or get killed, that's fine too. I'll take a crit. Are nearly fucking dead. No, Exorcisme. Hmm. 
That's a kill shot on you. Definitely go for her. Excellent. Axel. Anybody dire? don't have anyone to dispense that to. Two hits. Yeah. And it keeps HMP up a little higher. Frightened right now, so your shit's all messed up. Be gone. Nice. Okay, that slow didn't help shit.
Oh. To get closer to her. Damn. Okay. Can't reach anyway, so... Yeah. Oh, it does heal him. I thought he was undead. Then I can still shut this down. No longer an issue. Okay, I'm gonna have to pick up. Oh no, either one's gonna hit somebody. Because uh, I don't hit you. Oh, okay, you're the only one that could eat it though. How, how does that not work? How does that in her and not him? Fucking stinky. Hop over this way and just heal yourself for now. There, make that less of an issue. Got him. Don't worry, I'll lead you true. Hazelstan? Come with me, boy. I'll show you what a ghast thinks is worth protecting. Did I ignore the other condition? Oh no, that was the first one. Is clear with the dragoon. My ancient wood is useful. All right, I'll take that. Meditation for
What is this place? This is their sacred ground. Well, more of a dead end than anything. You see that chest of coins there? Take it. Better than going home empty-handed. Reputation and loyalty tanks if we take it. Or so I hear. I can't take this. This place is no treasure trove. It serves another purpose, though I cannot say what. These swords thrust into the ground. Someone left these here for something. Yeah, these aren't just scattered and laid there. They're placed there. As markers? Could this be a grave? Aye. This here's the place where the souls of departed pirates come to rest. No one mourns them, so they wander until they find their way here. The pirates' graveyard, this. Everything they left here, they left as proof they lived. Ah, a pirate's life is no glorious affair, and neither's his death. A few manage to come ashore, take a wife, raise a family, but most don't live half so wise. After your first captain and your last crew are gone, there's no one left to remember you. That's why they leave their swords. A nameless grave beats just nameless. If you can't leave your mark in any other way, you leave it here. Thus, a sacred ground and a treasure worth protecting. Or a desolate cliff strewn about with junk, depending on how you look at it. <laughs> Is that why you came? To pay your respects? <laughs> you think my heart beats as warm as that? I do. I have a hard time thinking you came all this way just to reveal the true nature of this treasure. There was a time when I lost sight of what was ahead, when my daughter died. I couldn't take the battle, so I came here. Maybe I was eager to join the ones who left these swords. The currents around here are treacherous things. Take your eyes off the sea for a moment. And she'll drag you down. Hmm. From the moment I entered the cave, I didn't pause to rest or think. I just kept walking deeper and deeper. I knew what this place was as soon as I stepped foot out here. I stood here a while, then went back the same way I'd come in. You just turned around? I did. This here is a place for those who went the full distance. Not for one like me, who always runs his flag at half-mast. I left my ship that day. Why? Because I had nothing more to do with it. That's why. I wasn't about to sail headlong into death like the ones here. Oh start a new life either dread pirate i was a coward couldn't put his daughter's death behind him hmm. but there is something that needs doing thanks for reminding me of that thank you for your help uh, 
sorry there's not more for you to take home than this uh, pile of coin. With luck, some of them will be old enough to have taken on a bit of value. Even so, these things aren't for anyone to use, least of all for war. I'll let it rest. Well, I wasn't expecting that from you. <laughs> Let's return. We're not meant to be here. We have things yet to do. New title, He Who Tread Holy Ground. Do we get anything new out of this? Yep, over Ripples of Grief. Then On Holy Ground. And the Pirate Sanctum. Uh, let me at least read these. Devils were set by apparitions seeking to prevent him from reaching the pirate's treasure. And on Holy Ground, Janet reached the low soul of the pirate's graveyard. A spirit appeared there in the form of Azelstan, blocking the way forward. Janet reached a place sacred to the pirates in the bowels of the pirate's graveyard. Well, Azelstan revealed the true nature of the pirate's treasure, learning the truth, Denim chose to leave empty handed. I didn't mean to play it again. Nothing new has happened on the way out. Uh, Pirate Azelstan. And legendary Gogstani Pirate in his younger days, he's known to all who sailed the seas of the land. Oh, he's greatly feared by a bandit when she sent away both cargo and lies. Said to have returned to unscathed from the deadly pirate's graveyard. After his daughter was slain in battle, he put his plundering days behind him. He went on to lead a life of debauchery at Port Amish until the ravages of war compelled him to take up his blade once more. He led Denim into the depths of the pirate's graveyard and revealed the secret of its treasure. New here. Nope. Titles, though. He who treads holy ground. Could have gotten the title of Grave Robber and get all that shit. That's it. Yeah, we, we out. Whoop. Do the shop. Cash that in. Oh, I could get weirdo people here. Ah. Uh. I have one that's ravenous, but I don't have one of my own. Oh, we can catch someone from Zenobia? What? Yeah, I'll grab one of these, though. Uh... Just gonna scroll and push a button or two. Doesn't matter to me. Definitely want to rename, but I'll have to think about that for a second. Because I'm creative. Just give the word. But yeah, uh, next time we continue with the plot, I'm going to upgrade a little bit of equipment here. All combat is over. Now that you've tasted victory, I'm sure you'll be back. <laughs>